hello guys welcome back to the channel and in this video i'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab so first of all just simply log in with your credentials and once done with that just simply come back over here and just simply activate your cloud shell it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile in the description box of this video i will share all this command so just simply basically copy all this command like this way and come back over here paste hit enter wait for a second and then just simply click on this authorize now this command is going to take a couple of minutes meanwhile what you do just simply search for the big query open this thing new tab and just simply come back over here wait for a second and then just simply click on this done over here just simply click over here now what you do just simply come back to the lab instructions and click on the task number four now just simply copy this query copy like this come back over here and click on this untitled over here now just simply paste the query over here and just simply wait and once you get a green tick over here then just simply click on this run over here and if you are not able to get a green tick over there just simply come back over here refresh the page and again copy the query just simply like this way now once you see the output like this way then click on this save result and just simply choose a google sheet over here just simply click over here wait for a second now and then just simply click on this open over here like this way now it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile what you do just simply come back over here and click on the task number five just simply scroll down and from the point number three you can see in g column what we do we have to just simply give the new field name just simply copy this name come back over here now here you can see g column just simply paste the name over here like this way now again come back over here now just simply copy this thing carefully copy like this come back over here and just below over here just simply paste over here like this way now just simply click on the share icon like this way and then click on this restricted and just simply choose a quick live over here like this way and once it's done then click on this copy over here copy like this and then come back to the big query over here now just simply click on this down arrow then click on this arrow and here you can see product table name now what you do here you can see e-commerce data set just simply click on this three dot and then click on this create table over here like this way now from here just simply choose the drive over here like this way now just simply paste the link which you just copy from here this link okay now just simply come back over here and as a file format just simply choose a google sheet over here like this way now for the table name again come back over here scroll down and from here you can see this table name so just simply copy like this come back over here and just simply paste the name over here like this way now just simply scroll down now here you can see schema just simply click on the checkbox for the auto detect and then click on this create table here here just simply wait now and it's done now if you just simply come back over here and click on this check my progress you will get a green tick over here without any Issue. and if you are able to see the check my progress for each and every task you will get a score without any issue just simply wait and watch and as you can see it's done and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys